Hey guys, it's your girl Anne and I'm back today with another video. In today's video, um, first of all, thank you so much for stopping by today. I appreciate you. However guys, spring is right around the corner and you guys know we as um, creators, we like to share inspiration a little bit early. So in today's video, I am sharing a little spring, insp spring <laughs> inspiration and just showing you a few things I did to just bring in a little bit of the spring vibe into my living room by just refreshing it. Um, you guys know I love to shop my home and use a lot of things that I have and for when it comes to like seasonal decor, except for christmas i just like to sort of um incorporate that seasonal color or whatever it may be into my existing decor because i don't really like to go out and spend a lot for any seasonal decorating so i will do things like you know change out my florals um change out my pillow covers and just incorporate some color for that particular season so that's what i'm going to be sharing with you guys today and that is just my screensaver that comes with my lg tv that you guys are seeing over there so starting out with my sectional all i did in my sectional guys was to switch a few of my pillow covers out um i think i've shared with you guys before a great way to refresh and update your sectional or your bedroom is by you know purchasing um pillow covers from amazon they come in different colors different patterns to suit your taste um whatever shades and colors that you like so what i've done here is i've kept my velvet black pillow covers that i got from amazon i've incorporated these beautiful greek key pillow covers that i ordered from h&m home last year so this is also shopping my home and just using what i have and i love this pattern and you can also mix and match patterns just once it flows and goes well with um, the patterns that you're incorporating and mixing together. So over here, I've added these beautiful velvet um, sage green pillow covers with a little bit of a creamy white and a little bit of a gold banding around it. These are new. I did get them from Amazon. And... Um, if you guys don't know you see my pillow my original pillows that come with my sectional sort of has these colors on them so i try to um match those colors when i'm incorporating seasonal decor except for when i use red for the christmas holidays it still went really well with my sectional but the sage green and like the tealy blues go really really well with this sectional so that is what i've done on the sectional i've kept my same black throw blanket that i got from i think i got this from amazon i have a cute little basket there with some extra blankets for um cuddling up when we're watching like netflix or just relaxing or whatever so that's pretty much all i did here on my sectional budget friendly refresh by shopping my home and using whatever i have and just incorporating incorporating two new pillow covers but i did tell you guys february is my birthday month so i did do a little bit of a shopping and purchased a few a few little things to um, refresh the space a little. Over there, I just switched out the wall art that I had there and I just added this one. It should be um, hung the other way, but I just chose to hang it that way. I've had this for a while. I got that from, I think, HomeSense or either Winners on Clearance. Sorry, guys, I'm a little bit under the weather. So, yeah, that's all I did, guys. Not blowing my budget or going crazy spending just to um, refresh for the spring season. So here on my coffee table, I've added, I switched out the previous decor that I had here for the winter and I brought in these two beautiful um, vessels that I got from H&M Home last year. I've incorporated these beautiful um, eucalyptus stems that I got from Amazon. I shared it with you guys. Um, a few videos ago and then all I did was I incorporated these cute little tulips I purchased these tulips maybe two three years ago 
and it just brings in a little bit of that greenery you guys know i decorate with black and white all year round but i do incorporate color for seasonal purposes but once that season is over the color goes away and i go right back to my regular black and white so i love to incorporate a lot of greenery and then for the summertime i will bring in like um white roses just to soften up the black and white but with this, um, what I love about these tulips is that it has a little bit of greenery. So that is usually my pop of color that I will bring in through my florals or, um, yeah, or my pillow covers. And then this is a cute little piece I recently got from Winners for $14.99. It can actually be used as a vase for you to um, add florals to or greenery, but... <laughs> I'm just decorating it as is and then I brought in some coasters usually for the spring and the summer I like to decorate my coffee table with some um, coasters it adds you know a little decorative a little extra decorative but it's also functional because you can use it for your beverages in the spring and summer months sometimes we like to hang out in here and you know watch Netflix and things like that so I love having some coasters to help protect your coffee table and then these are a few new books that i shared with you guys a while back that i ordered from amazon they're um by joanna Gaines, the magnolia table books and then these are just um a candle set thing here that you can clip the candle wick and then this one is to out it it came with three i think i shared it with you guys before um, from Amazon and then the candle is from Winners and that is pretty much how I refreshed my coffee table really simple I didn't break the bank but I love how everything looks it ties in well with the colors that I have going on in my sectional and I just love how that looks my sectional is from a furniture store, a local furniture store here in Canada. The Ottomans came from Wayfair a few years ago, and my area rug is from Walmart. I plan on changing that out really soon and adding something that goes more with my palette. The gray and white still works really well with my black and white, but I want to get something that has like black and a little bit of gray and a little bit of off-white in it and get rid of this. And then I just added this throw blanket that I got from Amazon a while back just to bring in a little bit of that pop of color in this side. Even though it's not the same sage green color, it's still within that green color palette and it still looks really, really nice. So over here on my end table, the lamps are from HomeSense and I've bought those a few years ago the coffee table books both came from amazon a few years ago and then all i did was i removed the eucalyptus, eucalyptus stems that i had here and i just added my tulips and i recently got this from wayfair it's just a cute little decorative piece and that's just how i refreshed my end table guys the curtains are 96 inch and they came from jisk the starburst mirror there came from the same company it was gold no it came from home sense and i've had it for about 10 years they don't sell them anymore it was gold and i painted it black the beautiful full tree came from amazon a few years ago and then here on the entertainment bookshelfy thing that I have here under my TV I've kept it pretty much the same from when I last shared it with you guys in my winter reset and refresh video the lady came from winners sometime last year all of my coffee table books are from Amazon except for this one I purchased from HomeSense a while back and then I've just added this cute little bowl you can also add this to um, your entryway and it can be used for something to place your keys in as you come through your front door the vessels on both side came from winners last year and i think they were like 19.99 like i said the coffee table books are all from amazon this piece is from amazon and this is a new piece that i recently got it's really really heavy the base is marble this was 24.99 and I think it is so cute and it goes really well with my decor. Very modern, very, very pretty. 
yeah and that was $24.99 and I recently got that from Winners this cute little table came from HomeSense a few years ago it's actually a nesting table that comes with a taller one but I only ended up getting this one it's actually gold but I did go ahead and spray paint it white this little vase was a DIY the inspiration came from H&M home because you know they have a lot of vases on there with this sort of um I don't know how to I don't know how to describe what they are but these are little foam pieces that I used to and then I um I adhered it using um my glue gun and then I painted it black. And those are just some um, greenery that I've had for a few years now. I think I got those from probably Michael's or maybe Dollarama. And that's pretty much all I did to just give the place, just give the living room a little refresh for the spring. I didn't do much, I didn't break the bank, but I just wanted to bring in just a tad bit of color into the space. I don't know if I'm gonna keep that um, throw blanket there color is a tad bit off even though it's within the same family I think the I don't know comment down below and let me know what you guys think should I keep the blanket there the throw blanket or should I get rid of it but yeah that is all I did to refresh my living room for the spring I hope you guys enjoyed this video I just love to share budget budget friendly ways of refreshing your space by just incorporating you know a little bit of color to your existing decor that way you're not going out and breaking the bank purchasing unnecessary things that you definitely don't need but yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this video comment down below let me know what you think um give this video a thumbs up don't forget to subscribe double tap your post notification bell that way you'll always get alerts each and every time I upload a video. And yes, guys, the entryway table is here. I've just been really, really busy and um, <clears throat> not feeling that great right now. But the next video <laughs> that I upload will be the makeover and refresh of my entryway area. Anyways, thank you so much for stopping by today. Have a beautiful and blessed day. And I will see you guys in the next one. Bye. Even if you're asking